Hello and welcome back to Baddy Train with me Barton and Walter here. I suppose we've got Jeremiah as well. He's not on the train though, so when you get on the train, Jeremiah, we mention you a bit more. Okay, so what do we need to do? First of all, we need to go to Boston and deliver our food, but also I need to check that my train is full. So Goods wise we're full, but we do have room for some passengers, so let's see if there are any passengers here that we could maybe... Oh, no, hit the wrong one. Let's see if there's any passengers that we can maybe take to Boston from New York. Okay, let's go back to the station. Okay, so let's check the passenger list. Cleveland and Washington. Sorry, can't do either. I'd love to, but no. Okay, so off we go then back to Boston. Okay, and we shall deliver the food. I'm here concerned the delivery of three units of food to Boston. I've got the goods and I hope you're ready to pay, pay me. Okay, guess he just paid me, didn't say anything, okay. Oh, hang on, that's my choice. Why am I saying to him, have a nice day, good job? Or maybe that's what he said to me. I don't know. Looks like it's my choice though. Okay, so we can't do any of those. We need to increase our reputation here. Yeah, reputation is minus two because we failed some stuff. So the next thing we should do is go to the market. Okay, we have our steel, which we'll check the price on. So steel, yeah, it's definitely best to sell that here. Let's sell both of those. Okay, nice money going up. We like that. Then, what can we buy here that would be good to sell in New York? Well, we're going to Portland first. Though. So let's buy something to sell in Portland. Okay, so Boston prices, Portland prices. Cotton, be a decent, decent return. Tobacco hardly worth our time. We'd lose money on that. Weapons, again, hardly worth our time. And the same with medicine. So I think it's got to be cotton. So we get four, it's cotton. Yep, we buy all four, thank you. Then do we need coal? No, we've got half half of our coal supply still. So let's head on back up to Portland. Travel up there. I wonder as well if when you change to a different train, hopefully it does on the map changes it to to the type of train that you be. Now, next, let's first of all go to the market and sell off our cotton. Okay, there we go. It's the cotton gone. So, not a, not, not a bad return there, is it? Let's go to the station. Then, let's check. Okay, so we have their book going to Utica. So if we can get a license for there, maybe we could do that. Then the other thing that we could do is maybe go to the depot. So what we got? Little passenger carriage, small cargo carriage, extra small caboose. So that would give us 
some sort of Oh, that would be like a passenger thing. Next. Okay, looks like that's all we have. And I don't really want to be spending money on that when it's not really an upgrade on this. So let's go to the map and see if we can buy ourselves another. So this is to Utica. To use this railroad, you have to buy a license. Do you want to buy a license for transportation from Boston to Utica? Yes, I need this. Okay. So that's that's sorted. Now let's go back in here. We pick up the two passengers. So you're going to Utica. We'll definitely accept you. And Cora Barrett will accept you. Good. Then we should go to the city hall and see what they have. Okay, deliver two units of tobacco to Utica. We shall accept that. Okay, then this one. Supply run, four units of weapons. Bring four weapons to Portland within 24 days. Yeah, we can do that. So let's do that as well. Let's accept that task. Okay, and then we can't do the others. But if we do those two, we will be opening up the others. So, hang on. Cora is in the... Why is she in this one? She should be down there in the, in the lovely passenger carriage. Now, let's go to the market and see what's best to buy here. And sell somewhere else. So I'm guessing anything with low prices would be good. But we do need to get some sort of volume. So the alcohol might be good. And if we don't sell it in Utica, because we don't know the price, we could still sell it in New York. And that would be pretty, pretty decent. So let's fill up on three of those. So Cora, I'm really worried about you. Especially now you're in here. Are you gonna drink all of our beer? Hope you don't. Okay, so Cora may be a little bit tipsy when she she gets off the train. Now we're gonna head to Utica. Then we pick something up there to bring to New York, I think. Oh, hang on, we need more coal. Okay. I always forget the coal. There we go. Let's we'll take that. Thank you. I wonder what happens to the excess coal though, because it's not like we're buying two tons, but I, I don't think we actually needed a full two tons. But I guess that's the way it's sold, so it's probably a bit of wastage. Let's go there. Okay, let's see. Monthly report. Okay, lost a bit of money which is fine because overall I think we're doing a pretty decent job and part of that as well though was like buying contracts or buying licenses and upgrading a train and stuff so overall we're doing pretty okay cash flow is okay which at, at the start of any small business cash flow is more important than profit because you could make, be making tons of profit, but if you run out of cash, you're going to go out of business. Whereas you could be making losses, but if you're cash rich, you're going to be okay. Now, let's see. Let's go to... Oh, they are... Yeah, let's wait until opening hours. It's only an hour and ten minutes. Anyway. Okay, good day. Take a look at the urgent contracts list. I'm here concerning the delivery of two units of tobacco to Utica. I've got the goods and I hope you're ready to pay me. Okay, so you did pay me, which is good. Now, what have we got here? Deliver two units of cotton to New York. We'll definitely accept that. Okay, and then we shall check. Oh, we have to get our 
well it says here it gives the prices okay so food prices here are the same as as Portland so it doesn't make sense to sell them here so we should s oh hang on wasn't it beer that we got them? yeah so beer is actually cheaper here so it'd be better in the future to buy beer here and sell it in New York okay so that's good to know but then here cheap food is good as well what's actually good to sell here so maybe steel from New York we're doing that trip what else then gun gun parts definitely here buy it in New York sell it there it's not as good a markup as this but in terms of actual cash flow that's going to be better then what's this one here? cloth yeah, cloth's definitely a good one as well. And then jewellery would be a decent markup. Yeah, so there's plenty of things that we can bring here that will get us a bit of cash. So let's go to the post office and let's get ourselves subscribed. And then let's see who's going where. So you have She's gone to Cincinnati and to Philadelphia. So we're not going to do either of those. Let's check that we are now full again. Yes, we are because we have the, the alcohol. And let me just remember about the alcohol. Yeah, we're selling that in New York. Okay, so next thing to do then is to head on to New York again. So Big Apple, here we come. Alcohol is contraband. Oh, so we are actually like it's like prohibition. But we'll see what happens. Hmm. I like how we just magically turned around there. In New York, the following goods are contraband. Contraband detection probably is six percent. Mm. We're gonna take the chance. We have to. Yes. Please, 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 please. Warning, all prohibited goods were confiscated. Ah, damn. Okay. Uh-oh. <laughs> Walter will be in prison for 30 days. What? Medium carriage available in Utica. Okay, that's nice. Oh, we got an achievement as well, Jesse James. Okay, but we can get a medium carriage. So Walter is back with us now. Bit of a jailbird. Okay, so. Don't bring alcohol to New York again, I guess. All right, let's go to City Hall. Oh, he doesn't do business with us anymore. Oh, probably because of the contraband. Okay, so. Is this gonna mean this city is growing too fast? So are you, lady. Cut down on the pies or whatever you're eating. But talk about growing too fast. Most of the guys, well, they, most of the guys look like they're growing too fast as well, but I can't th talk. I've got a huge stomach. <laughs> Okay, so enough about my weight. Let's. Your reputation precedes you, and it's not a good one. No one wants to travel with you. Oh god. So this is going to be a problem for us. <laughs> right. So hopefully they'll sell us stuff at least, and then we can. Hey. Did they take all my money as well? I think they actually took all of my cash. Why did they do that? That's not fair. 30 days in jail, all right, but taking all my cash, that's just not on. Okay, what does this say? Walter Reed is wanted in New York. Walter Reed is wanted dead or alive in New York. 
Okay. So, can he like turn himself in? Let's go talk to to Jeremiah. Let's see what we're supposed to do. So, let's go to let's go to Boston first. Oh, we, hang on. Are we now stuck because of this stupid thing? Okay, let's... Yeah, I think we're going to have to get ourselves stuck. We can't afford that. Okay. What I have to do is I'm going to have to load back to where we were before because... Yeah, what's this going to say? Current tasks. Yeah, unfortunately we've got to load back to before. So let's load. And then... We definitely don't want that. So it's got to be this one. Load that. Okay, so lesson learned. Let's see who's going where. Okay, Cleveland and Washington. Can't do either of those. Pick up the urgent contracts. Okay, 16 to 2 to Utica. So let's buy that Utica one now. Yes, I need this. Thank you. Then let's go to City Hall again. Okay, we need more. Ah, we need cargo space as well, so we can't do that. How about these guys then? Cleveland and Washington, we can't do those. Now, what was good to sell in the idea? Why didn't I remember? I could have been gun parts, but they may have been... Well, we're gonna stock up on some steel. Because we're already full of everything, aren't we? Yeah. Okay. So we have our food and steel. Now, where are we selling the food? Food's best to sell in New York. I think we're delivering that somewhere as part of the task. Yeah, we're to bring that to Boston, aren't we? So we can't do that. And in the steel, we should sell in Boston as well. Okay, so we go to Boston, then we go to Utica. Right, Boston, here we come again. And we're definitely not going to be taking contraband again. Like fair enough, go to jail and stuff, but wow, that really like it, it was basically game over. Right, so let's see. I'm here considering the delivery of three units of food to Boston. Here we go, we get paid. Now he doesn't have anything that we can well no. Cargo space four. Ah, so if we make space, we can do that. Right, well, let's make some space. Let's sell our steel. Okay, good. Then head on back to the station. Head to City Hall. And then we've got deliver four units of tobacco to Utica. We'll accept that. Okay, good. Then we should see what passengers we can get. Okay, so... Oh, okay, so they got... They need cargo space as well. So maybe that's why one of them turned up in the cargo hold. And then we can bring... Horatio May as well with us. Okay, so I think that means that our train is now full. Let's go to Mark and see. Yeah, that's someone's luggage. No? Oh, okay. But 
It was Amelia's luggage, so she gets to stay in the nice carriage. And poor old Horatio, who has no luggage, has to sit in with the luggage anyway. That's not very nice. Okay, well, off we go to Utica. Travel there. Okay, so we've got Buffalo. I've got two ways to go to Buffalo, that's interesting. Maybe one is safer than the other, or one is faster than the other. Okay, so here we are here. Go to City Hall. We've got our delivery for you of tobacco. Please give us some cash. Thank you. Then we can take cotton back the other way. We definitely accept that. Because now it's about just building up our reputation. And then let's see what we've got in terms of people who are going places, Cincinnati and Cleveland. No, we can't do either of those right at the moment, but in the future maybe. Then, what have we got next? Let's look here. So, do not bring alcohol to New York. Because it's contraband. That's why it's so... Expensive against, and the same here. But you'd get definitely gun parts because it's not even contraband. Look. Okay, so what should we get here then? We could get some oil, but it's going to be cheaper to get that in New York. Food is the same price here and Portland. Then fur is definitely a good purchase, but not really much of a markup and not much cash flow either. Alcohol is a decent purchase here, but then we'd have to sell it in Boston instead of in New York. But I think that that'll be okay. And then the other thing, so definitely cloth from New York to here would be a good thing. Cloth and gun parts. Cloth has a higher markup though, so we should remember that. Now, before we leave Utica, we need to go to the post office because we haven't signed up this time. Okay, there we go. And then I want to go to the depot to see what we have to Small passenger carriage. So that's a better train, but we don't have the cash for it. And then that's a small cargo, extra small caboose. Okay, so I guess next time that will that will become available. We can't take either of you. We do go to the market, and we had decided to buy fur. Can you confirm that? Alcohol and sell it in Boston. I think that's what we decided. Okay, so let's buy some alcohol and sell it in Boston. Do not go to New York with the alcohol this time. Okay, but before we go to. Yeah, actually, no, I was going to end the episode, but I think the best thing to do is to go to Boston and then sell the stuff there and then next time we can just take up from Boston we don't have to worry about we don't have to worry about oh what we were, what were we supposed to do so this time first time we actually made a profit at least that I've seen so that's pretty good although obviously we, we did kind of bankrupt ourselves as well <laughs> but not not in this reality that was a completely different reality Okay, so it's night time, but the market should be open, which means that we can sell our stuff. So the alcohol we sell, and then the cotton. Is the cotton for you guys? Let's see. Let's wait and then go there. Okay, so it wasn't for here. Life. Run five units of oil. So 
95 units of wires of Boston within 21 days. That's something that I should take when we start the next video because if I take it now, I'll completely forget about it. But that is going to be the end of this particular video. So I hope you've enjoyed it. I'm having fun with this game. It's a nice, um, it's a nice change from some of the games we've been playing lately. A lot of them have been kind of war-based games and uh, kind of very heavy, pretty heavy subject matter as well. So it's nice to have something a bit lighter and kind of with some of the other things on the channel as well like we, we started night in the woods which has a kind of a lighter side to it as well so so i'm enjoying that as well it's kind of lift the spirits a bit but as i said that is the end of the video i hope you enjoy you've enjoyed it and if you have maybe consider hitting the like button and sharing with your friends or on your facials favorite social media i keep saying facial so social media for some crazy reason just mashing the two words together but yeah, that's it. So I really do hope to see all of you next time. Goodbye. Thanks for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, maybe you'll hit the subscribe button there on the right and check out some other videos here on the left.